Two years ago, my husband and I decided we wanted to travel the world, but just shortly after my amputation, we lost our medical insurance. So we decided we would move to a more affordable country with medical benefits. Portugal checked all those boxes, so we booked a discovery trip. We just landed in Lisbon and seven hours in an airplane sucks for anybody, but not having a leg and then having to put it on whenever you have to go to the bathroom kind of sucks, but it's okay because I'm super excited to be here. My leg wins again. I got priority because of my leg and I skipped this like massive queue for customs. So always find the bright side. A solution? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's not attached. It's pretty. You buy silicone in same like this. Yeah. It's interesting. Mm. 
this is silicon. Oh. It's not liquid. It's... Yeah, oh. Okay, you pass here, you can mix mix with colors. Uh-huh. And after you you mold your your shape. Uh-huh. Yeah. And it's <laughs> the silicone is it hard like this? You you can make hard uh -huh. or soft. You you choose. You are this is how does hard. it hold you this steady? Is soft. Yeah. You can mix and make the silicone hard, soft, medium, what do you want? But if you have a soft socket, you'll won't you yes, fall? But you can make the socket here. Silicone. Uh-huh. Here it's oh, rigid, okay. and here soft. And here is soft. What? Maybe I'll get that next time. <laughs> I just left the prosthetist office. We're on our way to the castle. I can actually see it. Um, but what I wanted to say is that he is able to help me and I can pay cash. And they're very close to American prices, but in America, I have to um, go to an orthopedic surgeon to get a script, then go to the prosthetist, pay the prosthetist fee, then pay for the actual parts that you're gonna order this I can skip all of that and he can make a socket for me for my prosthetic leg he said for 600 euros which is insane to me because in the States it's like 20,000 that probably includes the feet components which I don't need I just need the carbon fiber socket and the valve and stuff but still that's that's insane you can pay for a plane ticket and the socket and still come out ahead if you're paying cash if you're actually um, using your insurance then obviously it wouldn't benefit you but as we all know, I don't have insurance, so this is the best that I can do. So I'm gonna do it. But I'm not getting a socket this year, but it is um, possible in the future. The best way that we have found to get to know local cuisine that you might be afraid of at first is the local buffet. So let's do it. Holy cow. Whoa. I don't know what any of this is, so I'm just going to... So here we are at the gas station doing our laundry. Because <laughs> why not? That's how we do things in Portugal. This would be sketchy, but it's Portugal, so we're fine, right? <laughs> what, like doing laundry at a gas station at midnight? Don't whack your baby in the head. <laughs> Don't when smack you, your infant. You open the door. Yeah, watch out for toddlers. <laughs> we are back stateside. That was a long flight. We still have two more. Um, something crazy happened. My leg swelled up. It's never swollen before. It swelled up like past eight millimeter. I couldn't even get my socket on with my rings. I had to do liner only. So I don't know what that was all about, but I stood around and stomped around um, in the back of the airplane for like over an hour like an hour and a half and then finally sat down to land um that was like six hours into an eight hour flight i don't even know anyways we're good all is well if i figure out what caused that i will let you know other than that security went fine i always get patted down which is nothing new but now we're headed home to go see our kiddos i hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for your support we have major big plans to travel next year with our kids. We are not done in Europe. We're not done in the world. So stay tuned. If you haven't subscribed, do it now because we're going to set sail pretty soon. Bye.